We have just discussed how to create archives and how to compress them. Also, I have shown you how to extract contents from the compressed archive. And for that you could use just single utility called tar. It is a very powerful utility and it has a lot of different other options. And before going on, let me quickly enter a command file and here will be path to archive and recap that we have created file called archive.tar.jz and if I enter such command, I'll see actually details about this file. And I'll see that this file is jzip compressed data. That actually proves that uh, this uh, file was compressed using jzip utility. Alright, let me quickly go one level up and remove this temporal folder rm-rtmp and also let me remove archive tar.jz because I have placed it in the root directory. Alright, now we are good to go and in this lecture I'll explain you how to sort files and how to sort contents of the file. And for that we will use two commands ls and sort. First let me demonstrate you how you could sort uh, files here in this output. And notice that by default files and folders are sorted by names. And here you see that names start from E and the last name has Z in my case. Alright, let me demonstrate you how you could sort this output for example by size of every file or directory. Let's do following. Let's ls dash dash help and here I'll use grab and let's find all options that have sort somewhere like this. And I'll see that there are some options that have sort in description. For example, using dash capital S, we can sort by file size and largest files will be first. Also using dash dash sort option, please note that this option is different from dash capital S, because those options are located on different lines. This option has additional mandatory argument word. And we could use here such words as size, none and for example time. And with this option dash dash sort and argument time we are able to sort files by creation or modification time. Alright, let's now try those two options. And first let's try dash capital S. Let's clear terminal and here type ls dash l and capital S, press enter and here I'll see that files and folders will be sorted by file size. Of course we are able to add here additional dash h option human and now we will see sizes in kilobytes, megabytes and so on. Also we could add additional option r that will reverse sorting and now I'll see smallest files first. That's how we are able quickly sort files by size. Now let's try to use dash dash sort option ls dash l and here let's add the option sort and here will be equal sign and if I'll press enter now I'll see actually all possible arguments that we are able to use along with dash dash sort option. And let's sort for example by size dash dash sort equal sign size. Recap that here we supply argument for this sort option. We have talked about that before. All right. Press enter and now I see that uh, files were sorted by size. If I add here additional h option, I'll see actually same result as we have seen before. And it is actually alternative for dash capital S option. Alright, now let's try to sort by additional argument and that will be time, time of creation. Time. And now I'll see that files will be sorted by modification date. And newest files appear here first. Notice that this file was modified at the 1st June and the last file in this list was modified at the 27th May. Alright, now let's also sort by extension. Here will be extension. Like so. And now I'll see that uh, txt files, for example, will be placed at the end, pdf files will be grouped here, conf files will be grouped here. We have applied sorting by extension of the file. Alright, that's how you're able to sort the result of the ls command. Now let's move forward and uh, let me explain you now how to sort the uh, contents of the file. But let's proceed after the small pause. I'll see you next. Bye-bye.